I have a fabulous Dollar Tree haul that I cannot wait to share. I don't know. I'm a little bit afraid to show it to Bill <laughs> because my son and I went to the Dollar Tree and we went a little crazy. Uh -oh. So I cannot wait to share the Dollar Tree haul with all of you and actually Bill too. Hey everybody, it's Shelby with a Chick Plus 3. Welcome. So we are going to jump right into this Dollar Tree haul. I hope you'll join us. What do you say? Let's go. Let's go. All right, also for Vlogtober today, I got sent in a joke bill for our <laughs> battle of the jokes. <laughs> oh. All right, so this joke comes from Joan. So Joan, I hope that um, I tell your joke well. And it is a bad dad joke. All, oh, right? all right? So here we go. The badder the better. Yep. Why shouldn't you tell a secret on a farm? Why shouldn't you tell a secret on a farm? Because the potatoes have eyes, the corn has ears, and the pigs squeal. <laughs> That's a good one. It's That's a, a really, really good, good one, one Joan. Yeah, All good. right. I don't know if Bill's going to be able to beat this. It's tough. We're going to hear his joke, and then you guys are going to vote in the comments below, either for Joan or for Bill. And so many of you are so sweet, you're always like, sorry, Shelby, but I'm <laughs> choosing Bill. <laughs> no apologies necessary. It's all in the delivery. All right. It's all in the, the, the timing. <laughs> all right. You all right. do your Here joke, Bill. All right. What did Dracula say to the witch and wizard who were kissing? I don't know. What did Dracula say? Get a broom. <laughs> <laughs> Joan, I vote Joan, I vote Joan. That was pretty good. <laughs> vote in the comments below, Joan or Bill, and I will announce the winner within a couple of days. All right, we're going to jump right into this Dollar Tree haul now. So are you ready, Bill, yeah. to see what we got? Let's see. And I'm just looking because Mika Moo is right over here in front of us on the bed. And she's, she's looking like she wants to do a nosedive off the high board. Come see mummy. <laughs> All right. Now, some of these, I honestly, I'm going to be seeing them for the first time, too. I mean, that what sounds that crazy because <laughs> I paid for them. I generally know what they are but they had a whole display of them and i told our son get one of each oh boy <laughs> so uh, what they are are pillowcases they're by christmas house all right i think if you wouldn't mind maybe yep. we got to take one yeah, of these one out, out and i'm gonna start showing them i mean they look really really cool 15 so almost 16 by 16 inches but the packaging, I don't think it's going to do them a lot of justice. But we were looking at the Halloween stuff. We went around the okay. corner and saw an end cap and went berserk. Now, these are nice. One, they come with zippers. Wow. Really nice wow. zippers. Wow. Right, around the, on the bottom? On the yeah. bottom? Really nice zipper. Now, it, it, it's like a coffee uh, sack material, just a little bit more plasticky to the feel. Oh, but but I it's think... not thin at all. No, and I got to tell you, it's, it's like nice. coated inside. I have bought pillow covers off of Amazon, and these rival those for nice. sure. Yeah. And what's another, like, say, guys, you don't want to cover pillows. You could purchase your gift, put it in there, zip it up, and just use this as like a fun gift bag. And then the recipient could use it as a pillow cover the following year. Yeah. Do you want to open some of them and show those? I mean, and these are, these are gonna, really nice uh, really nice prints. All right. I'm going to, while you do that, yeah. insert, well, you try to insert a pillow. One? And Hopefully just so right we size. can get a good size. A good idea. A good idea to see the size. This is awesome. I mean, look at this. Oh, neat. I am so excited. Oh, and it's nice and roomy, too. I mean, it's oh, a good-sized pillow. But not used. oversized. This no. is a standard one. 
the zipper worked nice and smooth. Look at, guys, I just transformed, literally transformed my Halloween pillow for $1.25. I didn't have to go out and spend $10 to $20 on a Christmas pillow, and now I don't have to store a Christmas pillow. I just keep changing the covers season to season. Look at that. My zipper didn't split. It didn't break. These are incredible. Yeah, show them the others. These are really nice. Really nice. You, I, I wouldn't imagine they're a dollar Wow, $1. look at that. Nice Fresh print. cut Christmas trees with the black and white. Love, love, love it. Ooh, and what else? Look Farm at fresh. this one. Farm Fresh with the truck. Hot cider and hot cocoa. Talking about that, look at this one. <gasps> Ooh, so candy canes, yeah, right cookies, cocoa, and confections. Yes. <gasps> oh, I love it. And the zipper seems to be on the bottom of all these prints. Very nice. And you could frame these. I mean, you could just, you know, steam them out. You saw when I had the pillow insert in yeah. it, though. It pretty much, like, smoothed right out. Great all find. Right. So we picked up, I had my son grab one of each design that was available at our Dollar Tree. So there's we have four. Four, four. And sorry, Bill, not to like hit you in the face, but I know gingerbread is so on trend again this year, Look back the, from the 90s. The black and white buffalo check you love so much. Yes. Yeah. Wow. Fabulous yeah. find. Excellent. All right, now the next thing, this is a continuation of a collection that the Dollar Tree brings out every year called like Cobblestone Village. Well, mm -hmm. they had some new pieces. Now, this is a Christmas village that our grandkids love. And what we love about it so much is like we have that expensive collector's Dickens village that's all ceramic. Well, these are all plastic, so the kiddos can handle them, move them around, play with them, and they were only a dollar twenty-five. We don't have to worry about heirloom pieces being broken. Yeah, my father made us a, a handmade village, Christmas mm -hmm. village. For we have our, that too. Yeah, and we did not let the kids near that. Yeah, it's irreplaceable. Yeah. So there it is. What it is? Cobblestone corners, miniatures. But, I mean, look at this. That's really the nice. The sweets. Little cobblestone sweets and treats house. Now, we have from last year, like, the church. We have a house. Um, I think we have a toy shop. And I saw a bunch of the ones that they bring out every year yeah. in the store, I too. Ask you. But yeah. I found some new pieces, and I have more. So oh, this isn't the only it's not new the only piece. One. And it does have, I did pick one with a little tab in the bottom. Oh, nice. And, oh, here. You can't. Here, can you shut some lights off now? I'm going to try now. There's I guess, so much light in here. Yeah, I guess. This, it lights up very bright. It lights brightly, up yeah. really nice. And the color on this is beautiful. Nice. Now, we did just check these over. This one is really nice. But again, it is from the Dollar Tree. Sometimes there can be like a little bit excess of hot glue, that type of thing. So if you're picky about that, just look them over. But we got that one. And then, let's see, I guess this set we're going to show you together. And I love that these all light up. All right. And mm -hmm. the detail on this is fabulous. That's really nice. Look at this. Look at this. And the camper has the design on like both sides, like a real camper, like a door only on one side, and then the window with the little awning, a chimney. This also lights up. Now, I would say out of all the pieces that they had, the camper was the ones that you had to look over the most for quality and I put our son in charge of that and he did a really good job I have taught him well because I don't see any defects on this one yep the truck has some mold molding on it I wonder if those uh, headlights come on when the light comes on well here we might as well give it a try well and hopefully see. they'll be able to see it 
<gasps> they do come on? They do. Oh. Yeah, the little white lights come on, yeah. Oh, man. We can't see. They come on, they're yellow. Oh, they're yellow. Yeah. Oh, yeah, see? You see it back there? See the lights back there? Very nice. Very nice. Beautiful. These are really, I mean, I'm you know, really at impressed at with night, these. At, when the lights are low in your, in your house, they're mm -hmm. going to really show up real nice and, and have that comfy type of old-fashioned feel. Yes, yeah. very, like, uh, cozy, traditional yeah, nostalgic, Christmas. Yeah. Yes, I love those. All right, excuse me while I duck down a moment. All right, and then this is the last new piece that I picked up this year. That's nice too. Yeah. And this is a color combination that I've never seen before, and it's called Cobblestone Cafe. Look at, I just, to me, the yellow and the blue with the red and white awning, like, screams Nantucket. I just could picture this in, like, a seaside Christmas village. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I just absolutely love it. And again, cobblestone corners, and these are a um, Greenbrier line, so I thought that was really fun. Very nice. Something different. Yeah. I like the colors. If you don't like Nantucket, think Cape, uh, Cape May. That's mm -hmm. nice, too. Exactly. Yeah. Cape May, New Jersey. Yeah. Very fitting for that. So I thought that was really a lot of fun. Nice finds. I Go get them before so. they're gone, let me tell you. Especially those pillowcases. I know it. Not even Halloween yet. And yeah. it's like people were going berserk. Well, I would too. I'd grab up like you did. I'd grab You know, I might get an extra set for a friend too. Yeah. Who, who couldn't get out in, in time. In fact, yeah. here, you know what I want to show you next? These, I could not find the display any place. Somebody had tossed these in a spot in the store where the whole display wasn't. I searched the store. I never could find the display. So I guess lucky for me that somebody tossed them aside. But it's like I'm in the Dollar Tree all the time. And so at one time, there was they would have put out an entire yeah. box of this stuff, and it was already gone. But let me yeah. find it. All right, so this was all they had left, so I grabbed both of them, but they're the Cobblestone Corners Miniatures, seven pieces. So look at that, the fencing. Here, would you mind actually, Bill? I well, think we should open them up. Now, you didn't find this where look. you would expect it? That this was abandoned somewhere else in the These store? were abandoned in the Halloween aisle. Well. That one piece, and then here it is in white. So you get seven pieces of the little fencing with the wreath. And now my feeling is if you had no desire to set up a Christmas village, you could make your own little like ornaments with this yeah. stuff. This here has the snow on each side. You want to hold that? Oh, yeah. So look at it. it can, let me find something uh, flat. Oh, here. Look at this. So see, it can yeah. totally just stand up. And then there's the gate whoop, with the, uh, that's going to fall. I don't know if it's yeah, this let's or see. If, is there something? Oh, it's yeah. got a little, a little here, I could tag on it. Well, I don't want to rip my nails. Just got a little plastic yeah, bit a little that has, we can just. Yeah, it has to be filed down a bit. Well, there, I just All right. there popped it off. So look at that with the little gate with the wreath. So, so see, you just one. set these up around the houses. Three, four, five, Seven six. pieces. Yeah, you got six of the long fence wow. rails and a gate. Wow. So you can make a whole little fence around one of the houses. And they stand up because the snow mounds are yeah. on each side uh, supporting the fence. So how cool is and what that? Other, what other type available? We got them in white, Amber. too. Oh, I nice. really like the white. And I almost just grabbed the white one, but then I was like, you know what? It's the do they have, only two Do they have the, the wreath on the white gate? Is there, yeah, yeah, there it is. The wreath. Yep, nice. Beautiful. Now, the wreath, and uh, the white gate, instead of having snow, has like mounds of grass. You see that? That's oh, yeah. green yeah. there. So... Grass. Really, really nice. So cobblestone corners. So they've got accessories out if you're lucky enough to find them right now for the village pieces too. But where I saw just these two packages on their own, 
I grabbed them, we put them in our little basket, mm -hmm. and then I figured, well, if there's like tons of them, and we'll see, maybe there's something else we want more, but never could find any more of them, so we decided, you know what, we're going to buy those two and yeah. keep them, Look because sharp. the Grands are going to have so much fun making their own little yeah. village. All plastic. Kids can handle them. You don't have to worry about breaking. Yes, and for scale, we always use one of the Dollar Tree fake trees too for like the big town square tree, yep. and they set it up around that. In fact, you remember it was like the sweetest thing. The um, they did it for you after you had your transplant. They set it all up on the bureau top of the tree <laughs> in the village, and I had to be really good and keep my um like whatever controlling yeah. like wanting it to let be them perfect, design it let them do it, it. Yeah. yeah so that if everything was all like clumped together or all the ornaments in one clump on the bottom of the tree i just let it be because they did it special for billy yeah that was so sweet all right but i have more stuff okay more even yep. more we're getting near the end but all right and i think i we got i think we ended up getting one of every one of these because I could not decide color. So what do you think of that? I think these are great. Look at these. Yeah, aren't yeah. they beautiful? Bottle brush, do they call them bottle brush trees? Yeah, but yeah. what sold me on these, look at the bottoms, are like little candies, the stands oh, of see. the trees. Oh yeah. All right, look at it. it. It shows up yeah, like this that, one yeah. really got me because uh, the candy theme. It's like one of the little red and white striped peppermints. <coughs> so me. this is on the pink bottle brush trees. You have the green there. Yeah, there's a sort of a green red, green red thing going on. I don't know if you can tell there. It is. Yeah, there it is. And then they had this too, which is kind of. It's not white. It's it's, it's like an antique white, yeah. kind of creaminess. Sort of a creamish. There's a little bit of a yellow to it. Yeah, so they did a yellow and white, a which makes me type think of deal. exactly yeah. of a butterscotch candy on the bottom. So we picked out one of each of these. Now you can tell, at least on the pink and the green, because it stands out. Mm -hmm. They have the uh, they have the uh, flocking, the white flocking type yes. of look to it. Yes. But uh, it, it sort of uh, it sort of disappears when it's head on, and it shows up on the edges as it spins. Mm -hmm. uh, quite nice. I don't know how they do that, but it's quite nice. Uh, the green has sort of a neon effect too going on, which is which is great. Yeah, I thought yeah. that was like a vintagey green yeah. looking, like 1940s, 50s. This is definitely vintage looking. Yeah, yeah. And again, the flocking comes out as you turn it to the side, but as you look head on, it sort of disappears a bit and you see more of the tree. Yes. Beautiful. So that's what I really like about these because like they're different, they're pretty. Yeah, different. So even in the daylight, like when you don't have Christmas lights all on, yep. it still is going to have, I think, a really pretty effect yeah, to it. Nice so, pricing um, too. Yeah, I mean a set of three. I can't imagine like at Michael's or no, someplace. Maybe it. like a Walmart you could, but I don't, um, know. There's a, there's I don't a... know. I don't have luck. I see people show like awesome scores yeah. of Christmas decor at Walmart, but we have a, a really tough time ever maybe finding it's, Maybe any it's our outfits. Walmart. Yeah, maybe yeah. it just gets, you know, yeah. they run like, through it like a tornado or a hurricane and there's very little left. Th yeah, yeah, that's it. But so the Dollar Tree, yeah. you can't. So that's everything I picked up on this trip. But I think I have to stop saying that I am not going to buy any more Christmas decor at the Dollar Tree because I just can't help it. Don't say that. You got some really great stuff. It's going to look really nice and give us an upgrade if you ask me. Very true, but all right, you just heard it from him. <laughs> He's an enabler, guys. He is not saying, why are you getting more Christmas at the Dollar Tree? And I know he knows how much we have because you carry the bins up from the yeah, cellar. Yeah, well, you understand, I love the curiosity shop effect, the decorations. It's like the old curiosity shop, very especially true. at Christmas time. Very true. Very nice. Very so nice we color. are very fortunate yeah. that we are both Christmas fanatics and that Besides, we you, are... You put it up and take it down anyway, so I don't like it. That is true. That is true. 
<laughs> Nobody helps me do anything anymore with well, the decorating. Well, I, I take the decorations up and I put them down. Yes, into the cellar. That is true. Same that thing with the tree. True. She decorates the tree. I take it up, I take it down in the cellar. No, oh, that I'm not so sure about. Now that we switch to small trees, I think I get stuck doing that too. Oh. But we'll see. We'll see this year who gets to carry the trees up and down now the Now we stairs. got a camera. We'll see. We'll have proof. <laughs> All right, we're going to let you guys go for now, but we will, or at least I, will be back again tomorrow with more of Vlogtober fun. So we hope to see you back too. And remember, as always, until then, please be well. Be well.